Hello, Beatle fans, and welcome to Ringo Remembers. You know, people think that um, being in the Beatles must have been a lot of fun. Well, it was, most of the time. But um, sometimes it was bloody awful, especially towards the end. You we would it, argue and you know, fight. And sometimes the arguments just got bloody ridiculous. I just think we should go to the toilet. That's all I'm saying, you know. Sounds sensible to me. I am pretty full. You know, why is it we always have to do what you want us to do? Hey, I'm not trying to tell you what to do, you know. We're just human beings. It's a physical fact. I didn't design the human digestive system. You know, we just all need to go to the toilet. Simple as that. I really don't need the toilet. You did have that bloody big lentil curry, George. You're not listening. We don't need to go to the toilet. All right, maybe we do need to go to the toilet. Are you absolutely bursting up? So we all went upstairs onto the roof and we came up with another bloody song. You've got a pain deep down inside. Look on your face, you just can't hide. Take a load off of your mind. Take a load. Talking to you, it's something we all do. Girl, you know it's true. Oh, yeah, just go for a poo. Well, I couldn't. I tried, but it just wouldn't come. John was trying, George was trying, but we were all too nervous. But Paul, being Paul, just showing off, and well, he just pooed his brains out. Don't be afraid, don't mess around. Just take my hand and sit right down. Put on a smile, take off that frown. Get rid of those blues and flush away that brown. The number is two. You know what to do. Well, it was the first song to get into the charts about going to the toilet. That is, until the Rolling Stones released their shit album. And that was full of them. <laughs> 